Import stop button. Closing dialogue. <sighs> Hello, fellow tubers. Um, it is I. Well, that is. Click to begin importing from the camera. <laughs> yes. Uh, it seems that uh, OS X is a little lagging behind me here. Uh, it is I, Visionless One. Um, known by several other names on here, but uh, this is my primary identity. Um, here's the problem. And this is kind of an open letter to Microsoft. Their Hotmail website is notoriously inaccessible for those of us who use screen readers other than JAWS on Windows of any flavor. I use OS X and VoiceOver on this machine. I also use Orca on Vinix, which is a Linux for the blind and visually impaired. In both cases, every time I try to go to Hotmail to either view my emails there to review the junk folder before deleting email or doing anything else of that sort. In OS X, my web browser, which is Safari, uh, goes busy and it alternates back and forth between busy, ready, busy, ready. Uh, this is typical because uh, OS X and Safari are a competing product to Microsoft. Uh, still, this does not excuse Microsoft from making their site largely inaccessible to the blind on anything other than Windows uh, using their application like Internet Explorer or Windows Live Mail. This also means that anybody who uses Linux of any flavor with Firefox or any of the other available web browsers on there will run into much the same problem. And this is my big complaint with Microsoft and trying to get to their contact page to send a message to them is equally as problematic because they don't have um, a category under accessibility. In fact, they have no category under accessibility or anything related to it that I can send them a message on. This kind of, well, violates uh, the Americans with Disabilities Act here in the U.S., as well as probably some international treaties uh, with regards to blind computer users uh, anywhere else in the world. And what I'd like to know is, what is Microsoft going to do about it? I have spent all night trying to get into my email account on Hotmail. Now, I can actually get my email using mail.app uh, via secure pop and secure SMTP. That's not a problem. That was easy to set up. The problem is the other folders that are on there like drafts, junk, um, downloads, etc. I can't get to them. Uh, they won't show up here. I can't set up IMAP because that is a premium service and um, requires payment of money I don't have to Microsoft in order to have that premium service. So, this is what I would like Microsoft to do. And I would like everybody uh, who is even viewing this video to complain to Microsoft on their contact us webpage saying, hey, um, you're causing a number of users a problem. There's what 15 and a half or so million uh, blind and visually impaired people in the US. And that population is growing very quickly because the entire population of this country is aging. And well, guess what? Vision problems are a part of aging and a substantial portion of those people are computer users. And if they're having to use a screen reader and they're stuck with Windows and of course using <clears throat> JAWS, which is a uh, fairly expensive screen reader and uh, braille support agent, well, then they aren't going to use it and they're going to go elsewhere. And essentially this is what the market demands. If a 
company is not meeting the needs of its market, it either goes out of business or it adapts. Microsoft has done neither. And I would like anyone and everyone out there who even sees this video, send a letter off to Microsoft, call them on the phone, do whatever you have to do to bug these people because guess what? People like me, and we represent roughly about 5% of the internet users planet wide, which is a non trivial portion of the population, and we're growing. Um, people like me uh, can be a significant market force. We spend money like everybody else, we live like everybody else but we're being denied uh, via a roadblock, not of our making, access to the information that we have a right to get. I pay for my internet like everybody else. I expect to be able to access the information out there on the internet like everybody else. So, please do me a favor. Send complaints to Microsoft. Twitter it. Uh, post it on Facebook, hit it on StumbleUpon, put it on Slashdot, do whatever it takes to get the attention of Microsoft and tell them, sorry, you can't do business like this. Either adapt or go out of business. It's up to Microsoft to adapt because I can tell you I'm not a coder. I can't write a screen reader. Um, and I'm still only learning Braille, so that option's cut out too. Anyway, that's my open letter. Microsoft has to learn this lesson. Um, the last time that they were uh, taken to task in court over accessibility issues, well, they lost. And here we are again, only because it takes years to get it through the courts and the court of public opinion is actually considerably faster. I depend on the rest of you to be able to handle this. I've done what I can. Um, I'm going to post this link on every blindness related mailing list I can find. I'm going to put it on Facebook. Um, I'm going to stick it in Slashdot even. I don't know if they'll pick up the story. I don't care if they do or not but I still want Microsoft to know. There's a large number of us out here and we're getting tired of them not paying attention to us. We're getting tired of them denying us the ability to be able to live independently. And that's all I have to say. I thank you for listening.